joined here with Josh Coleman from Cab Screens Racing. So, Hawkstone Park, first race of the season, you could say. How are you feeling? It's been a real eye, a real eye, eye opener, so to be sure. It's been a great experience to ride against a, in the MX2 class up, up against some great riders. And how are you, how's the track for you? Of course, they've got the hill now, which is quite exciting. So, how are you feeling? It's been tough. I've been, uh, I've only rode my race bike a, a weekend, so just getting used to that. And it's, it's been real good getting used to it and dialing it in. Just hopefully it brings on a good season. And today it's just gave me a confidence. And what have you been up to during the off season? Um, mostly training. Get, got out to Dunkirk a few weekends on the sand, which is really important. But more than that, just getting focused for the season and getting ready. All right, and this year you're doing the Michelin MX Nationals. How are you feeling about that? Are you looking forward to it? Yeah, it's my first time doing the MX Nationals, so it's should be a good year I'm hopefully uh, looking forward to getting in the top six and trying my aim is to get on the box all right well sounds great good luck with that thank, thank you. you I'm now joined here with Chad from Passion Racing so Hawkstone Park first pro race kind of the season or pre-season even uh, your rider in MX2 just tell us a bit more about how yeah we uh, we got Dan Broth riding today uh, here at the Hawkstone Park International um, it's not really an important race to us because we specialise more in the youth and the amateur side of it. But um, it's just it's just bike time. It's, it's early season and we just use it as valuable bike time because we're on we're on Husqvarna this year, which is a new brand to us and the team. Um, and Dan's had a good day. He's, uh, he scored points and we're finished both races, so we're happy and we're going away uh, thin and healthy for the rest of the season. That's really good. And I've heard that there's something special about your team. So please just tell us about that. Yeah, the team's run uh, in a slightly different way to what other teams are run in the fact that uh, we don't expect any money from, from the riders, we, we basically pick up riders who have got natural ability and talent within motocross um, but may, may struggle financially um, and we offer that as a, as a full package within the team um, from products um, and even this year Gatorade and, and, and fitness side of it, that's involved as well so we're creating a full package for a rider that can help them and benefit throughout the whole season. And this year, your team is riding for the Michelin MX Nationals, right? And how are you feeling about that? Are you looking forward to that? Yeah, we're looking forward to it. I've been fortunate enough to go to um, the series last season, taking a couple of races. Um, and the series is great. Um, you know, Gatorade is, is one of our sponsors also, and I believe that they have an input into the event. Um, and we feel that it's, it's a good series, and it's a series that we want to be a part of. Um, and I'm really looking forward to it. Yeah, good luck with that. And the Thank rest you so much. Thank you. Cheers. Thank you. Cheers. Thank you.